The use of expression peculiar institution, peculiar here means special, possibly with a positive implication, to refer to Southern slavery, positive implication, and that's exactly right. Did you know that slave owners are business owners? So why would you purposely damage and destroy your property? But this is what Northerners have us, or mainly abolitionists have us believe that that's what Southerners were doing. And that black people were so feeble-minded and docile that they just tolerated that kind of barbarity that was perpetrated on them. Which if you know anything about black people, we wouldn't tolerate that. So the Northerners were very nasty towards black people. I don't think most people know that. Very nasty towards black people. The Southerners actually respected black people more than the uh, Northerners. So that's why they called it a peculiar institution because why in the world would it be a big deal if Northerners treated black people like crap and the Southerners treated black people like crap? Well, you equally treat them like crap. But if the Southerners treat them with a lot more respect, oh, that's a peculiar institution. <laughs> That's why they call it a peculiar institution, because black people were treated a lot better in the South under slavery than in uh, the North when it's a free system. Because I keep on noting that when black people got out of slavery, that's when we started getting attacked and marginalized, put in prisons like crazy, you know, destroying our property and, and, our, and our communities, our homes, and just murdering us and getting away with it. Like, what is that? Under slavery, you couldn't do that because you're destroying property. The slave owners would come after you or they would get the authorities to come after you because you're messing with their business. They're not going to tolerate that, right? So that's why the Northerners, they would say that two things, sla slaves are lazy, which is kind of weird, and also um, that um, slaves like to be taken care of. So slaves like to be taken care of because they didn't have to worry about health care. They didn't have to worry about food. They didn't have to worry about shelter. And they were protected. They definitely were protected. But once they lost that property status, oh, it was game on for the bigot racist people. They just, they just went ham on black people and started targeting them. So slavery was a peculiar institution because they were protected. They were a lot more respected in the South than the North. And Caucasians and Negroes got along a lot better with each other in the South than the North.